بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم Now the next device we have something like a router. Now router is a device which connects two or more networks. Like if you remember we discussed in the previous section we discussed about WAN, wide area network where you got one LAN in Hyderabad branch branch office and you got another LAN in Bangalore let's say this is my head office now you want to make sure that these two LANs should connect to each other and exchange the information so which means nothing but I, I want a WAN connection between these two so when you're connecting two or more LANs that is nothing but your WAN now to connect this uh, these two branch offices will be connecting them to the router on both the sides and then the connection between LAN to LAN, the WAN connection is established by the router to router. So basically router is a device which provide, which connects to the LAN and WAN. Okay, so router to router, this is your WAN connection. So the router is a device which connects from LAN to WAN and is responsible for uh, sending a request from the LAN outside the network. Outside means maybe to a remote branch or maybe to a ISP. Like you can take an example of uh, LAN to LAN connections, two LANs or two WANs or LAN to ISPs also. The LAN to ISP means maybe you are connecting to a service provider from there you want to access internet. Now typically, now I want the user sitting in the LAN should be able to request Yahoo page. So when you send a request to Yahoo, the request goes to the router and the router will forward the packet to the service portal. From there it reaches the internet. So whether you want to connect to the ISP is also a different network, right? So basically you are connecting your network to a different network with the help of router. It can be within the company or within the outside the company like connecting to the service portals.